Hello guys and welcome to our next video tutorial about using Python async IO and uh, OpenCV together. Uh, so for this video I'm going to make change and apply uh, the new idea about this problem, uh, this project. How about uh, not uh, waiting for this edited frame from this uh, around face detection so how about not show this bounding box around the eyes uh, and uh, the the face so not showing this region of interest in the frame not waiting for this frame at all so uh, and what's the aim that i'm going to print only that uh, the face detected eye detected uh, or the the mouse detected so and show the frame directly without applying these bounding boxes and just you now let's dig into and you know, make the code change it will clear uh, it will clear up the things a bit uh, what we have here so i'm going to uh, make some code refactorings and remove this uh, awaits for async io sleep and add a new one to uh, this async io to this run blocking func uh, async asynchronous function and now let's save it and another change here mm, what we want so I don't want to wait um, wait for this uh, the running blocking func and I want to replace this two line with a single wait syntax so async io wait and add this uh, captured object frame and also this run blocking func let's just comment out here and um, do some yeah code cleaning and uh, what what I want to hear is that um, return uh, whenever mm, uh, whenever uh, the first uh, the first completed so if the show frame is completed so it will show uh, the frame uh, immediately to the user and apply uh, this run blocking uh, func uh, print statements to show the print statements uh, concurrently so there is a async io async right and we can pass this first completed so return when the first completed and the remaining thing is adding this print statement so if we have uh, we are in a phase so we can print that phase is detected and if we are in these eyes, we can also print the eyes are detected. And also the smile is detected. Smile is detected. Uh, so there's a code change, basically. Uh, let's just run and see if we can. Uh, improve our project so let's stop this nice mm. let's see so so eyes are detected face also uh, detected the smile is detected if if we can change, check that uh, our code is real time owner. So I'm shaking my hand. So as you see, uh, it's nearly real time. It's nearly real time. So uh, it's only half a second maybe or a second uh, delay. So I'm shaking my hand again. So yeah. And uh, so what we have changed is it's a crucial change so uh, we cannot apply uh, the copy in the uh, we can ch we cannot uh, add these uh, rectangles to the frame from an extract uh, external process pool executor or this is a separate uh, uh, 
uh, or operating system process. That's why we cannot share uh, our frame. So this is the uh, main problem of the concurrent and parallel programming, the resource sharing. So we have entered this as smooth as possible. So <coughs> yeah. And uh, now, now, so the, the lag is uh, eliminated to the minimum uh, and we can further improve our project here. Uh, for, for the sake of the clearness that, uh, again, let's just sum up. So we are not waiting in uh, the main pie. We are not waiting for running blocking function frame, it updated frame. Uh, and in fact, that we cannot even uh, just use this. This is not the same frame anymore. So it's uh, it's, it's going to run in the uh, separate executor. Uh, we are returning the frame, but not using uh, this frame in the show frame. That's why there is no uh, there is no lag. But uh, let's check again that if it's real time. So, so I'm closing my eyes. So closing my eyes. Yeah, as you see. So I'm opening my eyes. So it started to detect the face. So it's nearly real time. So we have achieved our problem. We have eliminated some lag. Uh, but it can be improved further. Yes, it can be improved further. So we will do, we'll do in the next uh, few videos. Uh, so that's it for this video. So the uh, simple code chains can improve the performance of uh, the concurrency performance of your project. Yeah, see you in the next video. Bye.